A pilot flew north from the airport for 88 miles, then east until he headed back to the airport on a course with bearing 210 degrees. What was his maximum distance from the airport? Well, it says right away, right, that he flew north for 88 miles. That's easy. And then he went east, so I noticed that that's going to be a right triangle, hopefully. And then he comes back to where he started. Now, what's really important is here is the bearing. It says that he had a bearing of, so that's this angle here, is 210. Well, if I went all the way back up, I could find the difference, right? So if I went three quarters of the way around a circle is 270 minus his bearing, so that leaves me with 60 degrees. So the angle inside here is 60. Well, if that's 60, and we know it's a right triangle, this is going to have to be 30 degrees. And based on the fact that it's a 30, 60, 90 triangle, I don't even need to use the law of sines. If that's the first thing you thought of is, oh, I'm going to have to use the law of sines. Well, you don't really have to. All you're going to have to do is use the right triangle ratios that we've already learned, which tell us what? Well, it tells us that the sine of 60 is going to equal to 88 divided by C. Now what is C? Remember C is your hypotenuse. And so when I do that, I'm going to solve, I'm going to get C equals 88 divided by the sine of 60, and I put that in my awesome little calculator, and that comes out with approximately 101.6 miles away.